A potentially violent psychiatric patient who escaped from a mental hospital in Hawaii may be on the loose in the South Bay. Honolulu police say he flew into San Jose Sunday night. Randall Saito escaped from a psychiatric hospital in Hawaii Sunday. Honolulu police said first he took a taxi to Honolulu. A dispatcher with the cab company described his demeanor. So polite, nice, and, and interact the way he did. How do you tell? How do you, how do you protect your driver for 22 minutes in a car with this guy? They didn't know the polite passenger had been acquitted of murder by reason of insanity back in 1981, or that a prosecutor said he fills all the criteria of a classic serial killer. After his cab ride, he chartered a plane to Maui, then flew to San Jose. He landed Sunday night around 7.30. An airport spokesperson told ABC7 News on Tuesday afternoon the airport security officer assisted the FBI and U.S. Marshal's Office in reviewing airport security footage at Mineta. Authorities say Saito is dangerous and should not be approached. In 1993, a court denied his request for conditional release, saying he continued to suffer from sexual sadism and necrophilia. Considering, again, going back to his violent past, um, he has that propensity for committing another violent offense, and we're concerned about that. Police in Honolulu are investigating how Saito pulled off his escape. In San Jose, Katie Marzullo, ABC7 News.